is going on? I don't know, I'm, you should be asking me what's going on. I haven't got a clue what is going on. We make a video, Stanley's absolutely fine, everybody's absolutely fine, and then Stanley gets ill. Oh, so we make a video. Oh, Stanley's got ill, but he's okay now. Don't worry about it, just letting you know, he's been ill. That's that. And then, just as we finished that video, I literally just finished editing that video today, and that'll be coming out to you guys in a few days' time, or whenever. Winston is now ill, and he's been sick. What is going on? So Winston was sick last night, which obviously to you guys isn't last night, but he was sick the night before I filmed this video, which is the night after Winston... No? I'm getting the names mixed up here, hold on. Winston was sick the night after the day Stanley was sick. Yeah. I don't know if the two are related. The Stanley was sicking up his, like, his dinner, and, like, he just wasn't going down, and he was just, like, you could see, like, there were chunks of his dinner where he hadn't digested it. Winston's, on the other hand, Winston's is just, like, bile, so he must have ate something, he's trying to, like, regurgitate it a bit, which is a bit mean, but... So Winston's been sick about five or six times this morning alone, and, like, twice in the afternoon. If there's a noise in the background, it's the washing machine, because he was sick on the bed, he was sick on the blanket, he was sick on the pillow, so we're just washing everything at the moment. So... It's just, I'm just looking after them really, these past few days I've just been looking after them, I've been trying to get back into the YouTube swing of things and get a routine going again, but it, ah, never mind. But yeah, so we put Stanley's down to him getting his wormer, but Winston's, I'm not sure if they're, now, my thought is, Winston at some point we may have ate some of Stan's sick, which has then made him sick. I'm going to assume that's what's happened because we've looked, there's no, he hasn't ate any bones, anything weird, and when he's been sick apart from like, a leaf. He hasn't been sick of anything else now. He hasn't been sick for a while, so I think that's maybe him done, but he's not eating. He isn't interested in his food at all, which you guys know for a pug is concerning, because if a pug doesn't eat the food, then there's definitely something wrong. Now, I'm just literally making this video just to keep you guys updated, keep in the loop with everything that goes on. When stuff like this happens, I'll let you guys know. Other than that, we'll just make what videos you want, like funny videos or whatever. We just want to keep in the loop, and then once he's better, I'll let you guys know, let you guys know if we have... Or we've if we find out what it was, if it continues, if it goes on for a few days, or it's just like a little blip. Because from dogs in the past and families, dogs and stuff, sometimes the sick feel sorry for themselves for a day and then they're absolutely fine again. So, I don't know, we'll soon see. It is getting late in today and he is getting a lot better, but obviously he takes priority over filming. I'm not obviously going to be filming him being sick and stuff or, you know, he's not eating his dinner. So I'm not going to go run and grab the camera to film him not eating his dinner and stuff. I did have my phone with us and I think I'll throw a clip up here or whatever. From a YouTube perspective, yeah, I should be documenting and filming all this so, you know, I could show you guys what it's like from start to finish, from starting and then working through it and all things like this. But from an owner and parent perspective, I'm just going to look after him until I think he's okay and then I'll do the video, so that's what we're doing. As you can see though, he's just feeling very sorry for himself. He's He's been asleep all day, he's just, he's not interested in his food at all. We've tried to give him a, just a little bit, he's not having it, we've tried to feed him various little different bits and bobs of other things just try and get him some food he's not having it but you're fine now aren't you yeah you're all good and touch wood you're still fine mister but you've had little weird things before but as you can see all the cushions and blankets and stuff are off the couch that i like the nice ones so obviously we don't want him being sick on them or anything but i've just been spending the whole day here with him See the kitchen roll because in case he was sick, I could quickly clean it up. We've just been watching a bit of catfish, so oh my first love, that was you, Pablo. Just in time. Chelsea will be fuming with that. So yeah, that's where we're out. Chelsea's mum and dad came around while I went out because I had to go buy a new duvet because he was sick on the duvet again. So we've now got another duvet. Because Stanley, you ruined the last one. The joys of dog ownership. Now, this is where literally doing this as a job is perfect. Like, yeah, I'm not a very good YouTuber, you know. I don't film stuff when I should, and I should probably film a lot more than I do, and I should upload more, and blah, 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 whatever. That's a different story. But things like this, when they're ill, there's no, like, oh, I've got to go to work today, and, like, there's going to be sick everywhere when I come back, and, oh, we need someone to look after him. Is anyone off? And do this, and do that. Like, I can just sit with them all day. I could just sit with them all day 
wait till they're better, you know, give them fresh air, take them out, comfort them. I think that's the main thing, especially for Winston. He just wants to be cuddled and he wants to just be loved. And I think definitely more before, but his ears were like right tucked back and he, he did feel really sorry for himself. And it looked like he was like, I want to say upset, but it, like he was going to be in trouble for being sick, you know, because he was kind of like, oh, I made a mess of the floor, I'm sorry. But no, this is dog things. But yeah, just another update for you guys. Stanley is now fine. Winston is now not fine. Pablo is still fine. And yeah, also big up to anybody who's in Houston. Just big up. I actually can't remember what I put in the last video, but we did take Stanley to the vets, obviously about his eye and his being sick and stuff. We haven't took Winston to the vets because today is actually Sunday. And I don't think it requires an emergency vet call out to your house, which is what they can offer. Obviously, we can't just go to the surgery and speak to someone, but someone could come here, but it's gonna be very expensive for him just being a bit sick, so we'll see if it gets worse. But it's Monday tomorrow, so if he's still no better by then, we'll take him in tomorrow. And yeah, we'll post a video with an update afterwards and tell you what's all going on, what's happening and stuff. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Peace out, guys.